I'm just putting together everything that we've gleaned here over the several weeks of just focusing on this right here on this show. You know, Bucky Brooks, my colleague from the NFL Media Group, saying that you you know you don't trade up all that to get somebody who wasn't even the best player on the field on his own team in Mac Jones, who he said was like uh, you know Iron Man, where the 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 program and the coaching staff and the other players around him are the suit that made him great. Kurt Warner saying that you don't take uh, that big leap to get somebody who is similar to the guy that you have. You need to take somebody who is physically somebody completely different uh, with a bigger upside. And then I'm hearing Dan Orlovsky say, if you think that Mac Jones isn't an improvement over Jimmy Garoppolo, you're crazy. So what is your evaluation of Mac from what you see, Chris? Uh, 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 The first thing I wrote down about Mac Jones is, why, why don't people love him, right? That was my first evaluation. Like, when you watch him play, he's an accurate guy. He can move fairly well. He can hit. He can make some big runs if you, if you need him. But I would agree with the evaluation of, you know, is it different than what you have or have had in this offense, you know, RG three back in the day could do some of that in his rookie year coming out the the backside of this thing. Um, But I, I, I don't think, I don't think that Mac Jones adds an element that you don't truly have assuming Garoppolo can stay healthy. Now the, the back end side of this thing is, you know, I keep seeing Garoppolo back in new England. And I don't know how he's getting there. So if you take if you take Mac Jones, could Mac Jones be ready for opening day? Yeah, probably. I could see that. If you took if you took Justin Fields or Trey Lance, would you prefer them having a year behind Jimmy Garoppolo? And I would say, yeah, I probably would prefer that. So, you know, I, I think it a little bit of it depends on are they really serious about Jimmy Garoppolo? hanging in there and being the quarterback this year and developing one of those two guys, which is a very, you know, very thoughtful plan. Or do you go, I want Mac Jones because ultimately I want to flip Jimmy Garoppolo to the Patriots for a a bunch of draft picks and then go build the rest of my team. So there's something going on here that we don't all collectively know. Um, but it, it's it's one of the more interesting top of the drafts that I've ever seen. Hey, you watched all the way to the end. Thanks for that. Watch more right here.